Hi, my name is Danny Fleming of MA Properties. So what does delayed listing mean? When you sign listing paperwork, um, you really should be given a delayed listing form to um, sign as well. So what delayed listing means is it's an MLS requirement because an MLS is multiple listing service, which is the definitive record of source of where all listings in an area go um, to let everyone know that it's on the market for sale. So it's a multiple listing service. All of your subsidiary websites, oh, they're not really subsidiary websites, but all of the consumer facing, no, because MLS is also consumer facing, um, all of the extraneous, extraneous websites that allow a search capability for a consumer to use as to what's on the market, say for instance like Realtor.com, Redfin, Trulia.com, Zillow, Remax.com, ColdwellBanker.com, yeah, all of those different um, places pull the data from MLS. So MLS is the definitive record of source. And what a delayed listing means um, in MLS terms is effectively when you sign a listing contract, your days on the market starts from that day. But it's not even in MLS at that point in time because often the listing contract is signed two months in advance because it's, you know, you're getting prepared to come on the market or sometimes six weeks in advance or sometimes a month in advance or sometimes, you know, you get the, the drift. Delayed listing means that you're not going to accumulate days on the market until it actually goes into MLS. So it's just a way um, to signify that your days on the market doesn't start until it's actually your home is actually available for sale and is in MLS and searchable by buyers and consumers. So that's what a delayed listing is. Um, if you have any questions whatsoever, then please reach out. Um, my contact info is following and have a great day. Bye.